guys, thanks so much for watching today's video. I know it looks a little bit scary because I'm kind of a blank can canvas. I don't have my eyebrows or my lips, so it's kind of a little bit washed out right now because it's not finished. <laughs> Today I wanted to show you guys how I contour um, using drugstore products. Now I, I've shown a few um, rec in a few recent videos how to contour with like um, brands that you can only buy online or in um, shops like Ulta or Sephora and those can be kind of pricey. A lot of contour palettes start at about 40 bucks and above. So these products here are all under 40 bucks, clear under 40 bucks. And um, yeah, so super affordable and you still get the same look. So if you're interested, just keep watching. I'm going to start by wetting my beauty blender and I'm just going to use this Evian spray and you can buy this at um, Ulta or even Sephora. So I'm just going to go ahead and get this nice and wet. You can do this over your sink too, but since I'm filming a video, I don't have a sink around me, so that's this is how I'm going to do it. And this is how most makeup artists do it while they are on set because there's not usually a sink nearby. So I'm going to get this nice and wet. Kind of roll it over my face. You can also moisturize a little bit if you need to. So I'm going to do that. I'm just going to use L'Oreal Paris's Youth Code Texture Perfector and it looks like this. It smells really good. Another one of my favorite moisturizing products right now would have to be Hydro Boost from Neutrogena. It comes in a blue packaging. It used to be a Youth Code BB Cream from L'Oreal Paris. I think it was L'Oreal. Um, yeah, but they I think they discontinued it. They don't have it anymore and it was my favorite to put on my face when I didn't want to wear too much makeup. So now that my face is nice and moisturized, I'm going to go ahead and use some of the products that I found at Target and these are from Sonia Kashuk and I'm not biased because of her name. I just wanted to try it because it's a drugstore product and I wanted to show you guys um, affordable drugstore contouring. Um, you know, because there's so many Instagram pictures and products out there that are so expensive. Um, <clears throat> especially right now would be the cream or the contour cream kit from Anastasia Beverly Hills, which I just talked about in one of my recent videos. So you can use any uh, concealer or foundation sticks that you can find at the drugstore. Just make sure that one is really deep compared to your skin tone. And this one has to be about five shades deeper than my regular skin tone. Um, I wouldn't say the darkest depending on your skin, but you can kind of tell that it would go with my skin tone as far as contouring would go. So let's compare this color here and this shade here. You can see, hopefully you can see that they're pretty much the same thing. So that's why I got this particular stick and it's from, like I said, Sonia Kashuk number 18 Chestnut and this is just a foundation stick, right? Yeah, foundation stick. I also got another one and this one is lighter than my skin tone and this one is in Latte number 13 and it's pretty light and I would compare it to this one here or this one here. So you can see I've been using both of these so it's perfect. These um, are about $12 a piece and these here are about 40 bucks a piece. And um, you're not going to use all of the colors in this palette, so it does save you money because you're actually just going to be using the colors that you need. So I'm just going to go ahead and start marking on my face where I'm going to need the light color and then where I need the dark color. And the great thing about it is that you can just apply it to your face like you would a marker or a crayon. So you know exactly where this baby is going. Unlike the cream palette, you would need to apply it from the pan into your face. So it just cuts off one extra step. I actually really like the consistency of this stuff. It's kind of thick, um, but it's got full coverage and it's not like thick where you feel like you're putting glue on your face. It actually feels about right as far as foundation goes. I want a little bit of this around my mouth too. Right 
I look a little bit like an ape. It's kind of scary. Okay, so next what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray my face a little bit, and this is going to help kind of move it around so that I'm able to blend it. So give myself a quick little spray. Then using your ble you ble ugh. then using your beauty blender, you're going to go ahead and blend all this in. Okay, so since this tutorial is a drugstore tutorial, I'm going to use Maybelline Fit Me in the shade number 230. It's one of my favorite drugstore foundations. If you've been watching my videos, you know that I have been favoring um, this one from Smashbox. It's called Liquid Halo in number 5, um, but I like both of them. I just was starting to try out the Smashbox um, foundation and I loved it. So I'm just going to use Maybelline today. And this is just the regular one. Um, I know they have a matte one as well, and I'm going to do a review on that because I just I love this formula. So I'm not sure how different it's going to be. I might do like half of my face with this one and then half my face with the matte. Um, but yeah, so stay tuned for that. So I'm just going to go ahead and apply this. I like to concentrate this product in um, the bright parts of my face because I don't want to go over the contour too much because I still want to keep that brightness. So for my contour, I'm going to go over and set, start setting my face makeup. I'm going to go over um, this foundation just in the cheek area. This is called the Bronze Booster from Light to Medium from Physicians Formula. I'm not sure if this is their current packaging because they've changed it several times. But I'm just going to go ahead and apply that right where my contour was. It has a little bit of shimmer in it, so it is going to help with my highlighting process as well. Next, I'm going to be setting uh, my entire face with number 220 um, Natural Beige. This is from the Fit Me Matte Poreless line, Matte Plus Poreless line. So I'm just going to take a puffy brush or a fluffy brush and put that right underneath my eyes first. Here. there we go. I'm going to use a little bit of the e.l.f. Contouring Blush and Bronzer Palette. And this one is in Turks and Caicos. So just a little bit of that because this is super pigmented. I'm going to add that right here, right into the hollows of my cheeks and just bring it down and then blend it. So this is pretty much it for the contour. Then I would add my eyebrows and my eyeshadow and my lips and my blush and my highlight. But I'm going to save that for another tutorial. I just wanted to just strictly focus on drugstore contour. So I did my contouring and also my powder. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!